uh, right now they have Team Hawaii come up. These are the top runners from all islands in Hawaii. Come on up, guys. Just line up. And, um, these are the top runners in Hawaii who will be chased by some of the top runners in the world. You guys can just introduce yourself and go briefly where, you, where you're from in Hawaii. Uh, I'm Jimmy Davis. I live in Kailua, Hawaii. And I've been running for about 15 years. And I'm honored to be here. Thank you. Hi. interesting with the chase uh, this is a prize money race uh, first across the finish line will win five thousand dollars uh, professional or team Hawaii uh, so because we go ten deep in the prize money that means we have four uh, professional athletes here that means by definition six of these people are going to win some money on Sunday but there's a real big drop off between first and tenth but don't feel the pressure uh, right now I'd like to introduce uh, the voice of the Hapalua and the Hanu Marathon and uh, really many other incredible races around the world, the man, Tony Revis. And guys, these are the people who are be hunting you. You'll be the prey and they'll be the hunters. <laughs> Let's begin with a, a young man from Japan who is uh, just beginning his professional career, just turned pro in 2016. Uh, but he was a great start with Seda University, which is one of the great running universities in all of Japan. He's already a 101 30 half marathon of Yuki Yagi. Yuki? I thought that might have been his name, yeah. And then two guys from Kenya. Uh, watch out, one young man is uh, freshly out of university as well, where he took his teaching certificate. But uh, he has also just recently turned pro with the Run Check Racing team, which is a frog based team. Uh, he's also a very fast runner with the 101 personal best so far. This is Philip Tarbe. First international race. 20 hours from Nairobi. And uh, also joining him from the Czech Racing team is a young man who last weekend in Prague at a, a major world half marathon took sixth place in 10103, oh. although he has a, a personal best of uh, one hour and three seconds. Uh, a very fast man. Watch out for him. He was second last year at the BAA 10K. This is Mr. Uh, Kipjanic. Abraham Kipjanic. donut in them later today. <laughs> Slow them down a little bit. <laughs> you could use a donut or two. <laughs> and then also one of the, uh, maybe the favorite in the race. Uh, last year for the first time here at the Hopalua, 
the professional uh, women's uh, runner won the competition. The uh, silver medalist from 2004 in the 5,000 meters from Kenya, Isabella Ochichi. Uh, this year we have a very strong uh, women's professional athlete from Japan. She's the 2013 IWF World Marathon bronze medalist. She's the Japanese national record holder in the half marathon. Uh, just a, a four-time Olympian, just a, a brilliant runner, a 222 marathoner. And uh, she is here to compete with uh, all of you people. And it is uh, Fukishi. Ayoko <laughs> <laughs> Fukishi. From Japan. And she will have a six minute, I believe, head start on the uh, professional men. So those are the people who are chasing those people. <laughs> What we base the handicap on, Jonathan, where's Jonathan here? Jonathan does the handicap and puts Team Hawaii together, so he's a legendary Hawaii runner, so let's give Jonathan a big hand. <laughs> we to some extent try to base the handicaps on the winner running somewhere around 103.30 to 104 minutes, right? What did you say? Somewhere, one, somewhere around 104, 104.30. So uh, for you guys, we think you're going to have to run 104, sub 104. You're getting six minutes head start. You're going to have to go sub 110. Figure out your handicaps, guys. And for a Team Hawaii uh, runner to win, if we do this right, the Team Hawaii runner should run a PI. <laughs> Thank you. 